What is up my friends? Hope you're having a good good day. We are doing a uh, training for the upcoming legendary Pokemon tournament. Your days are getting about to get a lot better if you're watching this video. Let's bring those wings home. They are training for the tournament to Mew, Talonflame, Polydode, Urshifu Dark. And uh, Intellion, so this is a, a water team, even though it doesn't look like it. Polydode, uh, Raichu has Lightning Rod, and Intellion here to sweep. Intellion is the weakness of my team, because it gets Snipe Shot, and uh, its ability... Its ability ignores even Gastrodon's Storm Trend, but it's not the end of the world. The question is, I have... Uh, are they gonna bring Raichu? I kind of feel they're going to be greedy and go with Polydode and Intellion. It looks like it's going to sweep my whole team, even though it's not. So... Do I still want... Ga Gastrodon's still decent here, is it? Uh, I guess it's better than Tyranitar and... Uh, let's do it. Hope you guys enjoy. I have a goal to get more uh, 100 subs this year. If you feel like it, help me out, press that thumbs up button, all of the good stuff, bring more people here, and we can all talk about Pokemon and gaming and stuff and enjoy, enjoy all of the good stuff together. Mew and uh, Intellion, that's even more interesting. But they didn't bring Raichu, which is perfect. So we always spore this one and uh, we KO the Intellion. Don't think I know what you're doing. They're going to Gigantamax Intellion and uh, they're going to ally switch with Mew. And uh, your boy, boy is gonna get an KO. Something's going to sleep and something's gonna get KO'd. They are not switching out, which is interesting. That's still not the end of the world. We do reveal elect... Huh. The U-turn... Okay, weakness palace in Mew. Yo. Huh. I was sure they were going to ally switch. But if they didn't bring Raichu, they're in trouble. Because Sehian is going to destroy that Intellion. If Mew doesn't KO as Politoed, things get even more intense. What is this Mew going to do? Psychic, okay. This is why we have Focus Dash on Among Us. And uh, thank you Polydode for stopping by. Hmm. Kinda wanna sludge bomb here. I kinda wanna switch out also. I kinda wanna KO the Polydote. If they didn't bring Raichu, they don't have any switch ins. But this feels pretty safe. Uh, uh. I guess this is the play here. We'll see what's gonna happen. If Mew protects, that's fine. Mew dash protect, that's a bit of annoying. I could have KO'd Polydoed here, but I was a bit greedy. That is a bit unfortunate. But I don't, the way they're playing, I don't think they brought Raichu, so I'm going to sludge bomb Mew. Uh, nope. I'm going to sludge bomb here, and uh, I'm still trying to KO the Mew, just... If they didn't bring Raichu, they have no switchings. Yep. I could have also sport the Polydote slot, I guess that would have been a little bit more safe, but... 
Yeah. Or protected, but that's fine. Because now things get interesting. Now, the, the reason why I did this, I could bring Gastodon, but I kind of want to bait them into attacking Charizard. This is... they have to do this. If they brought uh, Raichu and they haven't revealed it, like, good for them. That's crazy. We're going to max guard and just trying to KO the Inteleon. I think if, if we can get rid of the Inteleon, we, we win. Zayhans should outspeed both of them, so they have to hard switch in the right two in order to make an make this turn count. But even if they do, I, I still think we're fine. Because charge out outspeeds Polydode. Max guard. And now we KO Inteleon. This was just if Inteleon Gigantamaxed. Okay, they have focus dash, so. Huh. Yep. That's what, what they should always do. Unfortunately, Inteleon had Fogger Stash, but this is still fine. So now... We are going to max Overcrowd to Polydode, and... Uh, I guess we just Wild Charge here. This, this should be pretty... Foolproof. They ah, uh, they are probably going to actually Dynamax the Polydot. They have to do it. Unfortunately, Inteleon had Fogger Stash. If it didn't, we have, would have definitely changed into Gastrodon, and uh, Charge Heart would have swept the entire team. But okay, it, it does even have a Protect, so that's. This player is pretty good, pretty good. Some people don't bring those protects, but... They should still do 50%, I guess. Polydot is pretty bulky. Let's see what they targeted. Haha, <laughs> it has eject button, okay. So that's not the Pokemon you want to Dynamax, but... If this is right too, I'm going to be extremely surprised. Takeo. Okay, it's Urshifu. Just the Urshifu. Zehian having this electric move is actually pretty technical. This is also interesting. Huh. So we always max airstream here and uh, we wild charge here. Yep, we take those wins, we take those wins. I gotta, I gotta give it to my opponent, I gotta give it to my opponent. They had good team, all the right moves. Inteleon is the weakness of my team. I have Gastrodon for water Pokemon. My two main sweepers are Tyranitar and Charizard, which are both super weak to water. But that's why I have Gastrodon. It has Storm Train, which absorbs the... Water moves, but Inteleons move Snipe Shot, and I think when it's Dynamax, it, it turns into Gigantamax Snipe Shot something. Anyways, it ignores the Storm Train, and it can even hit Gastrodon, so... But having that while uh, kinda hidden electric move with Zehian being super fast and so powerful... This is kind of what I'm trying to do with this. I'm trying them to bait, bait them into bringing the water Pokemon. Now, if this was something else than Inteleon, like Gastodon and Zehian, they just, they, like my opponent is going to have so hard time. And for some reason, I've noticed with this team, they do not respect Gastodon. They always think it's it's just in the team preview. I'm not gonna bring it, but I am going to bring it every time you're gonna bring a water Pokemon. 
hope you guys enjoyed this is going to be the video for today see you next time 